guys, it's your boy, Reese Boy, back with another video. Just got out of the shower, so I'm like, my hair's still wet. But anyways, guys, I wanted to tell you, today's the day. We're going to celebration. My appointment is for 10.30, so I'll keep you guys updated. I just wanted you guys to know today's the day. I'm so excited. Um, I've been trying to get back to this place for so long. So hopefully today we'll know, like, um, what's the updates? What do I have to do? How long do I have to diet? Um, and then when, <clears throat> and when we can do the procedure that they're gonna do to help me lose weight. So I will keep you guys updated. I probably can't record in the doctor's office, but I'll try to get it as close as I can. And I will um, probably post the video this afternoon. So I love you guys so much. I will be back, okay? Bye. This is it. We're going into that building down there, Matthew. I know, and you're supposed to park right next to it. On the other side. Because remember, we had to walk all the way across the lawn because okay, we're here and we're going to go upstairs soon. There's the elevators. So we'll go upstairs soon. And I'll let you guys know what happens when I get upstairs. All right. Bye. What's up guys, it's your boy, Reset Boy. Back with another video. I mean, I'm back. <laughs> um, sorry, give me a minute. It's so hot in Florida. We're like almost to 100. It's like 99 degrees outside. Um, <laughs> we're in Waterford. Let me show you guys. Waterford Lakes and Waterford. And Waterford Lakes and Waterford. Waterford Lakes in Orlando, Florida. It's a big outside mall. Um, you got your movie theater, restaurants, BJ's, Best Buy, T-Mobile. There used to be an Apple store, but it's gone. But anyways, besides the point, um, <laughs> guys, I'm so excited. You don't understand how excited I am, okay? We got good news, guys. Like, I'm telling you, we got good news. The surgery is paid for. Like, I don't even have to pay for the surgery. My insurance covers the whole surgery that I'm doing. I'm doing the gastric bypass, and that means they're gonna go in and cut my stomach and rearrange stuff. Um, I will be on, I will be, it's a life-changing surgery. I will lose a lot of weight. I'm so excited because it's like, God answered all my prayers for everyone praying for me. I, I wanna say thank you to everyone who prayed for me. Guys, if you're with me, I'm so excited. Like, you guys can't understand. Like, I'm so excited. I could cry. Like, I was wanting this so bad because I was, like, worried about the money. My check is small. I don't make a lot of money. So, I'm, like, how am I going to do this? And I'm, like, God just, like, answered my, God answered my, like, everything. And, like, I'm so excited for, like, the future. You guys don't understand. Like, good videos are coming. Good blogs. Good content. They started me on a diet that I actually am going to start soon. I have phase one and phase two. Phase two is just getting you closer to um, surgery. And I'm really excited. But I'll be back, guys. I'll let you know when I get... Give me a minute. I'll let you guys know, okay? Hold on. Okay, guys. So I'm back home. So I just wanted to come on. Tell you guys everything. Give me a piece of gum. Best gum ever. Best gum ever. So, okay, guys. Everything went good. I told you guys that in the other clip... So now it's on me, like 100%. On me to lose the weight. Not on anyone else, on me. Okay? It's stressful, but I got it. I know I got this. I can do this. I want it so bad. So I know it'll happen because I want it bad enough. Um, um, yeah. So I just gotta make sure I focus, make sure I focus, basically, just make sure I focus and do what I'm supposed to do, eat what I'm supposed to eat. I have plan one and plan two. So there's two plans. Plan one is to get me ready for surgery, the food I have to eat. Plan two is what I'll be eating like a week before surgery and then after surgery for the rest of my life. So I was literally cutting my portions down to about this size, this size. And no more chips, no more soda, no more anything. And um, 
the part that the part that surprised me was that my insurance covers the whole pr procedure. It's called the drastic guy bypass. I don't know the terms, but that's where they're gonna go in and they're gonna cut my stomach. So it's gonna go from a big stomach to like half, almost like a moon. And then they're gonna rearrange my digestive system to where like they're gonna bring the bottom part up. So actually it's just gonna be better. Like I'll, I'll show you the paperwork um, when I get a chance to. And then I have to exercise a lot. I have to, I have to do like, I have to at least exercise for five times a day. I have to do smoothies. Sh I have to do two dairies a day. I have to do shakes. I have to do boost, boost drinks. So I got to start all that up again. Um, I have to eat salads again. And then they're going to stop my cumin in so I can do the procedure so I don't bleed out on the table. And today my numbers were really small. So I have to say so this is what they want me to do. It's 7.5 and then 10, 10, 10, 10 across the board. So this is what I got today for my cumin in. This is for the blood thinner. They poke you on the finger right here and then they check it. And that's what this is, that's what, this is for my cumin in. Yeah. Yeah, and that's what this is for. Yeah. That's what that's for. So basically I do that. Do my do then then when I do the procedure, I'm gonna try to record that so you guys can see that. Not like the procedure itself, but like me getting ready, prepped up to whatever. And there's not a certain goal of weight that I have to lose, but I have to show them that I can lose weight. Like that's what they want me to do. Show them that I can lose weight. And then my insurance needs me to see a nutritionist for three months. So that's fine, I already knew that, that's nothing. I can do that. I want it so bad, it's nice and funny because I feel like I've lost subscribers. I haven't lost any really lately since I reached the six, but I feel like a lot of my subscribers before that and the people that were following me before that felt like I was lying to them because I would be like, oh, and do say one thing and do the opposite. Guys, now that I know what I know today, and you know I was waiting for this day, July 18th was when I was scheduling my appointment. They want me to do this for four months. So November is when I could be, be closer to doing surgery. So I could do surgery actually about December. So that would be my Christmas present to myself, like a week before Christmas or a week after Christmas, whatever. That would be my present to myself. So that means I start 2020 with a new body, new person, new attitude at the world stop hating myself love myself guys just just be if you guys i know you guys love me and i know you guys are like support me and i'm so excited that you guys have started this chapter with me just stay on it's coming i promise you i know i keep saying that but now that i know what i know you're not going to see more sitting down blogs you're not going to see me you probably will for right now because it's going to take me a while. But, like, you'll start seeing me exercising, swimming. Um, I'm going to try to show you guys what my morning routine is again because that video did really good. Um, and then, like, I want to show you guys my diet plan. I want to show you guys how I'm cooking healthy so you guys can see that. And I don't want you guys to think that I'm just being like those other fat people that say something and then don't do it. I'm doing this because I want to. This is my last straw. Like... If I don't do this, I die. So it's like, I have to do this because I don't want to be 700 pounds. I don't even want to be 500 right now, okay? And I actually lost weight. I'm actually like five something. So like, I've actually lost weight because I was six something when I checked into the hospital. Like I was six six nineteen when I checked into the hospital. I lost 17 pounds when I was in the hospital. So altogether, I've lost 21 pounds when I came out of the hospital. And then... Since then, I've lost, I forget how much I've lost since then, but I am losing weight because I cut out a lot of stuff. Yes, that video that made people really frustrated was one of my cheat days. I can't have those no more. Like, none. None. Even if I'm depressed, angry, mad, want to scream, I can't anymore. I have to turn that into working out crazy, um, listening to music to calm down, posting a lot of YouTube videos. So if you guys 
Check out my channel one day and you see three YouTube videos a day. That means I'm very stressed out because I want to talk about it. Um, but I'm sorry video did really good. It has a 113 um, likes, so that's awesome. Um, I know it's not a lot, but um, I can't be picky. But um, I'm excited, guys. I'm very excited for the future. I'm so excited for 2020. I'm so excited for the end of 2019 um, to just have what I want so bad actually come true. I thought I could never do this type of surgery because I'm like, there's no way I can lose this by myself. So I was like, oh my God. So today when the lady told me like, we got you, we can do this. We got you. We believe in you. I was like, thank you. I was like, I need to believe in myself. So just what I want you guys to take from today's message and today's video, whatever you're going through, know that it will get better. Know that there's always going to be a better situation and better timing, better if it's relationship, if it's health reasons, if it's um, you're sad and depressed and have anxiety, just know that it'll get better. I've been depressed my whole life. I've had stuff happen to me my whole life and I'm now finally 30 years old and starting to see what life is about, okay? I've been stuck in Orlando, okay? Since 2010 is the last time I flew out of Orlando, okay? That's a long time ago. And now that I'm finally gonna get my life back and my body back, I am so excited for the future. I wanna be able to come to VidCon. I wanna be able to come to Playlist Live if I'm invited. I wanna grow my channel, do better videos, better content, collab with other YouTubers, cause that was another problem with my weight. Um, I still wanna start Orlando as a big YouTube community cause I feel like LA gets everybody. I wanna do one in Orlando. Um, I need to find me a trainer. I need, there's a lot, there, there is a lot of stuff that I promise you guys. Remember this day, July 18th, 2019, that I told you guys, I promise you guys, Pinky promise you guys, Scout's Honor, I think it's what Scout's Honor is this? I don't always remember, I was a scout and I don't remember. Isn't it Three Fingers? I don't know. Anyways, anyone who's a Boy Scout, no, tell me what it was. Is it Three Fingers or Four Fingers for the Scout's Honor? I don't remember. And I was a Boy Scout for just a short time because my dad had to work and we couldn't finish, but just for a short time, me and my brother were Boy Scouts. Um, we made it to where you do the race car, where you build your own race car and race it. We made it to that. And we got, I think, I forget which badges we got, but we got a lot of them before we stopped. I wish I could find my little vest. But anyways, um, um, I want this, guys. I want this. And if anyone who knows me knows me, who anyone who knows me who watches my videos, knows that when I want something, I do something. I wanted a YouTube channel, I made myself a YouTube channel. I wanna be big on YouTube, I'm making myself, I'm making a name for myself. Um, I'm on all the ver verified pages on Facebook. I have my own website. If you Google me, I pop up. If you type in Reesey Boy, the first thing that pops up really is my TikToks because that is that like one million point whatever I have on TikTok. So that's really what pops up first, but then my YouTube channel is there too. Um, and all the pictures of me when I'm fat, I hate that. But when I lose the weight, like I want to take new pictures, professional pictures. And I got to drink a lot of water, like six ounces a day. I was doing eight ounces. I was doing this a day. And they said, that's too much. Cause water weight could make you fat too. So I got to do six and I can't do anything with sugar in it anymore. So no more candy for me, no more gum. I don't know if I can, I can do fat-free gum. I can't do this type of gum. This has too much sugar in it. <clears throat> no more fast food, no more mukbangs, unless it's a healthy mukbang. So I can't do fat boys prefix anymore unless it's a healthy fat boys prefix. Um, and then I can't do, I can't try any new stuff. Like I wanted to try the McDonald's, the Burger King taco to tell you guys how it was. And I wanted to try the KFC cheeseburger, no, KFC's chicken, Cheeto chicken sandwich. But you know what? It probably wasn't good for me anyways, and I heard it was full of grease, so I'm not doing that. I can watch it through other muckbungers. Um, guys, I 
oh my god i'm sorry like i know i'm all over the place i just want this so bad and it's gonna happen and i'm like surprised that it's gonna happen because i feel like i have no good luck but i don't even believe in luck i believe in god and i believe that the angels are watching over me and i ask people to pray for me and people pray for me so thank you to everybody who prayed for me on youtube thank you for everybody who believes in me who has stood by me since i started this channel my number one fans we're still trying to figure out what that burping thing is um the lady's gonna call me and let me know if i can fit on her table <laughs> um so just thank you guys just thank you um and i'm so thankful for celebration i'm so thankful that they're wanting to help me. They're thankful that I trusted them. And I'm thankful that they want to help me. Like, that's what the biggest thing is to me, that they want to help me. And they didn't just say, go away. And they help thousands of people in Orlando or in Florida. They help a lot of people. It's one of the biggest overweight, I forget the term for them, but it's a big, big complex. Big. It has its own hospital. It has its own surgeons. And even women go there for their babies, too. So it's, like, really big. And I didn't even know we had one here. Kind of like in my backyard almost. Um, so I'm very appreciated for that. And I'm really appreciated for my mom and my dad. And my dad's good insurance. I'm appreciated for that. Because that helped me a lot. Um, and I'm just going to stop arguing a lot. And trying to be more like professional. And more giving. And more caring. And everything. And just loving people who want to help me. So anyways guys. Thank you for watching this video. Get ready for the future. Get ready for better, better videos. And I love you guys so much. And don't forget to get the coldest water bottle ever. And um, go share love with somebody that needs it. All right? Say Biggie Boy. Say, Biggie Boy. That was my nickname in high school. Say Reesey Boy sent you. Okay? Peace, guys. Love you so much. Bye.